SFX Entertainment has expanded its strategic review to include options for restructuring its debt, reports Lisa Allen, a senior reporter for the deal. But, Allen adds, the process promises to be messy and could result in a freefall bankruptcy for the music festival producer. An SFX spokesman confirmed via email that its financial advisor, Molis & Company, is looking at the sale of non-strategic assets as well as the capital structure, but he declined to provide further comment. According to hedge fund investor David Tao, co-founder of Maglin Capital, SFX has already had its assets for sale for some time now. The problem is that the small pool of logical buyers may be willing to wait to pick up the pieces at fire sale prices. Tao's firm Maglin Capital doesn't have a position in SFX. Tao said another issue could be SFX's bondholder base, who bought in due to the high interest payments, not with a loan-to-own strategy in mind. Furthermore, the bondholders may want the company's founder, CEO, and chairman, Robert Sillerman, out of the picture, considering his failure to effect a turnaround. But given the niche nature of the business, those same bondholders may be reluctant to take over the company during the restructuring process. As a result, SFX could face a freefall bankruptcy for which there is no plan in place and ultimately leads to an uncertain outcome. I'm Richard Collins with The Deal Report.